How's it going, everybody? It's Gorilla Man here, back with another Plane Mechanic Simulator. This is the second uh, second video I'm gonna do on this. Uh, it's gonna be one that we do like every once in a while, just something to spice it up a little bit. Um, in the first video, we went through just a couple of the basics, and in this, we're gonna continue going. So, we last video, if I remember correctly, we did oil, uh, tire changing, propeller changing, and fueling and refueling. So. Hopefully we'll be digging in a little bit deeper here now. So, oh yeah, this one I left off last time. Uh, okay, so it says, there seems to be something wrong with the new oil. The pressure is jumping all over the place. I've arranged for the oil to be checked, the tank to be cleaned again, refill it and find the cause of the problem. So we need to refill the oil, fix the problem with the oil system and refuel the aircraft. Alrighty, well, off the bat, let's start with refueling the aircraft here. Okay, I gotta get used to the controls again because these controls are really weird. Space to climb up. Alrighty, let's get the hose in there and then we gotta crank this. Turn it all the way. There we go, he's done. Then you gotta like right click to exit these things. I just gotta remember this. Alrighty, there we go. Where's the hook at? There it is. And then this guy will drive away. Yep, alrighty. And then we needed to fix a problem with the oil system. So let's find out where that problem is based at. Um. Let's see here. I'm trying to remember exactly what we needed to, to, to do. Let's go over here. Let's take this side off. Uh, I need to pull this menu back up. Um, oh, diagnostics was three. Okay. So it's the oil pressure system. Oh yeah, the oil pressure on the other side. Hold on, let me go over here. So this is, this right here is one of the things. What about the oil tank itself? Where does that one go to? I can't find it. All right, well, I'm just going to go through and check. Oh, there's oil filter. Okay, so the oil filter is what's damaged. Double checks and the oil filter, pressure filter, timing gear is fine. A lot of this stuff is fine. So yeah, I guess I just go through and I just click on things until I find the right one. So now to take this apart. Let's get this cowling off of here. Uh, I think I need to go to the other side really quick. I think to get the top cowling off, you got to go over here. There we go. Let's see if that'll do it for us. Maybe we gotta take the propeller off. Okay. So it's the oil filter and the oil pressure system, I think is what it was. So there's that off. And then the pressure filter. Okay, and I think that's it. Okay, yeah, those are good. All right, so then we're going to take this and we're going to fix the problem, which we're going to repair it. I think we're going to try and repair it. All right, so click on this guy and right there. Let's rotate him. I wonder if it'll stay red or if it'll actually look a decent color. Okay, so the way we repair these, if you guys don't remember, is you hold down. There it is. There's the other one. So you hold down the oil thing and you want to land it in the green. Ah, oh, I went over it. Okay. I got to hit one more. Ah, 
Got it. Okay. So fully restored. If you got three out of four, it'll fully restore. Oh, wait. We still have another part. What am I doing? All right. Then we need the pressure filter. Yeah. And the thing is, if we can manage to repair these, that's the good thing because we save money and we get extra XP for doing it. Okay. And this last one here. Come on. Ah, I messed it up. Uh, where is this last one? There it is. So we failed that restoration, which means I have to go over here and I have to buy it instead. And then we have to use a resource point. I got to sign this. All right. And then assembly. There we go. Yeah. So assembly in this is a lot easier than car mechanic simulator. You just like put the part in and then you just tap the screw once and it goes in for you. Which is super helpful. And then hit all these up. And then I think we need to refill the oil system also. So once this is done, we can do that. This side, and then this cowling can close, but this cowling cannot close because I need to be in there. All right, let's pull the oil bowser over here. Alrighty, there's the hose. Oh, hold on a second, actually, let me just put the hose back. There we go. Need to take the cap off, insert hose, and then let's pump this. So yeah, we're out of oil right now. So we want to fill it all the way up to the minimum, but don't go over the max. There we go. And all primary tasks completed. So it looks like we are good to go. I can just find out a spot to set this thing. I could close. The oh, there. Yeah, I forgot. I got to put this on first. And then I can close this. Lock these latches up. Check. Check. There we go. And this guy should be ready to go, I think. I need to double check and make sure I got that uh, the cap put back on the top of the fuel system. So there's that. No, we don't climb it. Oh, there we go. Ah, uh, yes. It's a good thing I checked that. And. Looks like we're good to go. Ta-da! All right, so refill the oil, fix the problem, we got it, and refill the aircraft. Perfect job, I'll take it. Okay, so then that's 186 points. So for us to upgrade to like aircraft second class, we have to hit five or 500 points, yeah. Alright, see what they do, have us do next. Looks like we're diving into the engine a little bit more. So we did the first part. So fix the propeller and refill the aircraft. Okay, so this one is way easier, actually. So, take the propeller off. Which I'm pretty sure this is going to be super easy. Okay, so there's the hub. There we go. And then the propeller comes off. And then we gotta fix it. So let's see if we can fix this part, maybe? Nope. We can't replace it either. Oh, wait. 
Hmm. So if we can't replace it, um, the propeller isn't tracking correctly. So I need to see which part's damaged. Maybe it's the hub here. Case fine. Engine cover fine. Front engine cowling fine. Uh, maybe we pulled the part off. Let's see. Okay, here it is. The air screw hub. This one is what's damaged. And it is not repairable. So we'll go pick one up. Alright, we'll sign for here. And then, so now that we got a new one on there, we can slap this one on. So we fixed the propeller already, super easy. Uh, not the propeller itself, but super easy. Now we gotta wait for this to finish, and then we'll put some fuel in, and we're good to go. So this is these these beginning tasks are super easy, and I'm pretty sure there is an there is an order we do these in. So, all right, nothing else. Looks good to me. Take the ladder, don't climb the ladder. Let's grab that fuel hose. This guy's pretty much empty. All right, good to go. Uh oh nope, we wanted to climb that. And there we go. Assignment complete. Only five points for that one. But we get 25 or something like that or 27 for completing the task which is great alrighty there that's uh, that's pretty easy alright so it looks like there's gonna be a lot of landings today make sure that that undercarriage is in good condition alright so we crouch a little bit we need to make sure that the undercarriage is in good condition so if we go into examination mode, how do we check the undercarriage? Let's see here. Maybe we can use the jack. Uh, pop this guy up in the air a little bit further for us and then there we go it's a little harder to get this thing rolled up all right and now that that's good let's see so we need to check the undercarriage now I'm trying to find out where exactly they mean by that Okay, let's check this. Right compression leg. Anything else right here for us to check? Oh, there was something. Oh, it's just the right compression leg. All right, so the, oh, the, oh, okay, so the wheel. All right, there's one. This wheel's damaged. Okay, so now that I see, it means we can do the wheels. So I guess the undercarriage that they refer to is going to be wheels. Get the spindle nut off. Let me check these. Can I check those? Nope. All right, wheels are off. Oh, 
Okay, so it looks like the wheels, both of them, we're going to have to uh, just buy new ones. We can't even repair them. Okay, cost and resources too. That's fine. And then, pop these bad boys back on. It's kind of nice that you can just exit off of a part and it'll keep screwing in. I'll wait till I finish hearing that. Alright. So then, for us to check more of the undercarriage here. Whoa. I'm just trying to find other parts that we can click. Anything else under here we can check? That's in pristine condition. I don't really think there's much more we can check. Mm -hmm. Undercarriage is in good condition. It is in pretty good condition. We've got a few of these things scanned. So, is fine okay condition? That's what, I think fine is okay condition, right? I think so. Not sure. Uh, let's go to the rear here and check. Tail skid. Okay, so tail skid's damaged. So how do we prop up? Okay, so this is the rear jack. Ah, oh, I'm seeing here. Okay. Is there anything else that we can scan back here? No, it doesn't look like it. Oh, wow. Teal skin has a lot of stuff on it. So does this piece literally just go down and just skid along the concrete? There we go. Let's see if we can repair this bad boy. Looks like we can't. Damaged. Okay. And we're going to need one more of these. Thank you, Chief. And we got to install about 10 more screws. And it looks like it did like that. So check the undercarriage is complete. And then we need to refuel this bad boy per usual. I think there's pretty much always going to be a refuel order on him. Okay. Grab our hose. Hop up top. Place the hose. Alrighty. Uh oh. Okay, looks like that one out without a hitch. Then let's grab this last guy here. Crank him down. And... I think we're good to go. Need to be installed. What am I missing? Oh my gosh, I know. I keep forgetting to top that cap up there. Aha. There we go, cranks into place. And there we go. Good to go. 
So now we're halfway to aircraft first classman or second classman. I'm not sure. Uh, I think we're private right now. But yeah, there we go, guys. Um, let's check out the next one. And then I think we'll end it here. That was about 20-ish about minutes there. So it was quite quite some time. We got, what, four tasks, three tasks done, something like that. Um, next one, they want us to check spark plugs and refuel. All right, so it looks like there's going to be a little, some slow stuff. So our parts of larger assemblies, these can be removed altogether. Which we covered later. Okay, so looks like we're still making our way through, getting stuff done slowly. But soon here, guys, I'm sure we'll be uh, diving into the full engines. But thank you all for watching. If you guys are enjoying this little series so far, leave a like and a comment down below. Let me know. If you guys haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button. And then I will see you all in the next Plane Mechanic Simulator.